In Jonathan Haidt's groundbreaking exploration of human behavior, the happiness hypothesis, finding modern truth in ancient wisdom, the renowned social psychologist unravels the fabric of human happiness, weaving together scientific studies, philosophical insights, and age-old wisdom. Haidt sets the stage by proposing a captivating metaphor, the human mind as a rider on an elephant. The rider, representing our conscious and rational thought, appears to be in control. However, the elephant, our unconscious, instinctive emotions, often has the real power. Through this analogy, hate introduces a truth universally acknowledged yet frequently overlooked, the complex interplay between reason and emotion shapes our happiness. This motif recurs throughout the book as Haid navigates ten great ideas, drawn from the philosophies of ancient civilizations and religions, and examines them under the lens of modern psychology. He explores notions such as the golden mean, the moral roots of happiness, and the pursuit of authenticity, challenging readers to rethink their assumptions about happiness. Haidt argues that happiness isn't about avoiding suffering or pursuing pleasure, as the popular hedonic treadmill concept suggests. Instead, it's about finding balance and coherence among life's various elements. This balance, Haidt suggests, is achieved by addressing the divisions within the self, between the self and others, and between the self and the external world. In his exploration of reciprocity, Haidt delves into the human tendency for cooperative relationships, revealing how this interplay impacts our happiness. This reciprocity extends to our relationship with the universe itself as Haidt challenges the Western individualistic mindset, urging us to consider the interconnectedness of all things. One of the book's most poignant segments is its exploration of adversity. Drawing on the ancient wisdom that suffering can lead to growth, Haidt examines the paradox of adversity. He illuminates how the worst experiences often catalyze the best changes, leading to what psychologists call post-traumatic growth. This growth, Haidt posits, is the alchemy of transforming suffering into strength, despair into wisdom, and tragedy into triumph. Haidt brings this journey to a thoughtful conclusion by urging us to reconsider our definition of love. Love, he says, is more than a fleeting emotion or a passion, it's a binding force that connects us to others, to our communities, and to the world. It is, Haidt suggests, a crucial element in the intricate puzzle of human happiness. The happiness hypothesis is more than just a scientific dissection of happiness. It's a thought-provoking exploration of what it means to be human. Haidt encourages us to examine our lives, question our beliefs, and engage in a deliberate pursuit of happiness that encompasses not only personal fulfillment, but also a deeper connection to the world around us. Ultimately, the happiness hypothesis is an invitation to the reader. An invitation to embark on a personal journey of introspection and discovery. A journey that blends the wisdom of the ancients with the insights of modern science, offering a profound understanding of the human condition and the elusive quest for happiness. It is a compelling, deeply enriching work that challenges our perceptions, nudges our conscience, and opens our hearts to the possibility of a richer, more fulfilling life.